This is the Haynes Boeing 707 Owner's Workshop Manual. Um, it's got insights into the design, construction and operation of the All-American Jet airliner that became the face of 1960s air travel. Um, another superb book um, for the um, bedside cabinet. <laughs> Um, yeah, 1957 to present, um, the aircraft are still used um, as military transport and uh, air tankers and stuff like that. Um, this book is by Charles Kennedy. Um, it's just been published in 2018. Um, really, really cool. Um, Starts off with um, the history of Boeing and uh, all the aircraft they made up until the um, start of the uh, jet age, and then it comes along to the Dash 80, which was probably the first modern jetliner, um, and then along came the um, 707, which was a game changer, um, carrying millions of passengers around the world. Uh, there's some great photographs on this um, from all different airlines. Um, a lot of Pan Am. Here you can see it with um, a Boeing 747, which came along in the late 60s and kind of dwarfs the 707. Um, 707s were pretty noisy aircraft, um, very loud. Um, again, um, that was the um, jet engine technology at the time. Um, here's a great cutaway with numerical um, indexing. Um, they were not an easy aircraft to fly. Um, and, uh, but there was a lot of them made and a lot of them used in every country around the world. Um, engine with all the uh, nozzles. A tough budget. Yeah, there's some cool photos. Um, so you can see the difference of CFM engines. I've got a very wide fan and actually use some of the um, thrust um, in the larger outer um, turbines. Um, CFMs. You see, like the original um, engines were very, very small. Uh, yeah, it's again fascinating and really interesting. Um, with plenty here for any plane spotter to chew on. Aer Lingus, the Irish carrier. Um, they used them until 1986. Um, yeah, so it's exhaustive. There's a lot of stuff in here. Um, it goes through some crashes and all that. And uh, that's it, really. Um, Great books and well worth investigating um, if you want to learn about aircraft, classic aircraft of the last 60 years. So yeah, it's um, certainly well worth having and um, check them out.
They're great.